Oh my god! How exciting is that? Hi guys, welcome to another studio vlog. My name is Nyx, I'm a part-time artist from the northeast of England. I'm actually in the middle of the design work for the winter collection. So I thought we would start the video by showing you some of the designs. I've sent off a few of them and I'm really excited about them. Um, I've actually been testing out things today for some more wooden pins. So I will show you those designs on my iPad. So this is my little Acon character that I created. I think we're gonna name him Oakley, which was my husband's idea. Um, I thought Oakley was a really cute name. Let me just put some texture on there. Look how cute! So I did him a few days ago and he's going to be a wooden pin and I'm probably going to get him made into a sticker as well. Oh, I've got something to tell you as well, that's quite exciting. So he's going to be a sticker and a pin and that's, so that's Oakley and I made another character, a moth, which doesn't have a name yet. I don't know what to call it, it's like a lunar moth. This is like a little updated version of a moth character I already had. I had it as a sticker and a bookmark and they sell out all the time the things with my lunar moth on but I thought I'd do like a cute little character can you see that so I thought she was really cute and I'm gonna get her made into a wooden pin as well I sent off those designs today and I'm probably gonna do a sticker and I might do a holographic sticker as well oh also I've got some the first things I sent off for the winter collection so I thought I would get some more stationery done because my mushroom notepads and planner pads sold so well. So I thought I need to do more stationery. So we've got, this hasn't got the text and things on, but this is the, the general design. I tend to put the text on in Canva. This is the design of the planner pad, which I'm really happy with. It's like got a little hot chocolate on the bottom. And it's got fairy lights around. It's kind of got like a wintry feel. It's like a cozy kind of fairy light evening winter autumn feel and I just love it and I've got a notepad version of this so I sent off for those actually like a couple of weeks ago now and I think they got dispatched I think they got dispatched this week so they may be arriving soon so I was very happy with those and I'm very excited to release those in the update so we've got a planner pad we've got a notepad we've got um, an acorn pin we've got a moth pin that I still need names for I'm sure I'll come up with the name during this vlog and let you know but I was testing out all the colors of them today and what size I want it to be and um, it took me a while to get to what I wanted for the moth but we got there and I sent them off so I've done that today I also filmed the results video for my Halloween marker that I did in October and um, that video will already be on the channel by the time you're seeing this so please go and watch that if you're interested in like art and craft markets and things because it was a very very good market so I'm gonna get started today on a sticker sheet I haven't done a sticker sheet in a while I'm, I've got a couple of designs from last year that I'm gonna get printed on my waterproof vinyl that I do now and I've never done that before for these designs um, so I'll actually show you them. So this is my most festive design. This is my festive foliage sticker sheet. Can you see it there? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to refresh it a bit and put my new logo on because this is from last year's. So I'm going to do that for festive foliage and I also have it in a natural colour as well. I do also have it in pink but I'm probably not going to get it printed in pink. I'm just going to get the natural and the green for the festive foliage. So those designs are already done, they're just being brought back. And then we also have Frosty Flurry here, I don't know if you can see that properly. That's in like a blue snowy kind of design, so that's good for like all throughout winter. Um, so I'm just going to change the logo on that because I rebranded this year. Um, and I'm going to get that done in the blue and probably the lilac as well. Because I think the blue is more of a classy version. And then you've got the lilac as well for like a little more of a... It's a little more of like a feminine kind of energy so I'm gonna get those rebranded and done that won't take too long and I'm gonna do a new sticker sheet and I'm gonna do 
a cozy evening kind of vibe so i'm gonna start sketching that today so let's get on with the sketching notepads are here for the winter collection and the restock of mushroom ones so let's open them oh my god let's get some scissors right so this is the restock oh this looks good yeah this is looking great oh excuse me so here's the restock of the Mushroom Forest notepads. These went out of stock really fast. And then, we should have, I can't remember if I've shown you, but we should have the Cozy Coco Cat. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> go away, go away. We should have the Cozy Coco Hot Chocolate Planners for the winter. Oh my gosh, oh my god, they look good, they look good. It's like a cosy fairy light uh, notepad, cosy fairy light notepad. And there's Coco, the hot chocolate. She's just chilling, because it's a cosy notepad. I'll have to test out the paper. How exciting is that? And then we've got the planners as well. Are ready? Oh wow! Oh my gosh, these feel good. These look good. These are so good. Look at these. Oh my gosh! And there's the cocoa planet pad. We got the fairy lights around, and then you've got the little emote here of the little cup faces for what you're feeling every day. You've got gratitude, notes and doodles, there's cocoa in the bottom to match the notepad. You've got for another day and then you've got little cups here to tick off your to-do list. And it's like an A5 square size, so it's perfect little size but not too small. You've got your days of the week at the top. Oh my god, I love it, it looks so good. I just need to count them all, which I will do soon. It's the weekend today, so I don't tend to work today, but I'll probably count them on Monday. Honestly, I'm so happy with them. Making our Christmas memories. I've been working so much lately. I can barely find the time to sleep. Yeah, spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you These are the good times with you Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me Hang by the fire and chill Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories Oh, and I've been longing to hold you close Forget about everything 
just been working on some social content for the week. I tend to keep it all in the preview app, so like I'll have the ones at the top and I'll have them scheduled to put on. Um, I don't auto schedule, um, I just don't pay for those kind of features yet. So I just manually upload them, but I've got three reels done for this week, um, which you will be on my grid by now. And I'm going to get on with my latest sticker sheet. And um, this is Cozy Evening. This is for the window update. I'm going to do two colour themes. So we've got like cozy blankets, books, tea, a uh, little bit of wool there, a little bit of yarn. Look how cute he is. Um, so I'm going to continue working on that this afternoon. And also, we've got some goodies arrived in the mail. I've got some more cello that I ran out of so I've got two sizes of that I need to sort out and I've got if this is what I think it is so this is my current corner rounder that I use for art prints and thank you cards and things but I actually injured my hand a couple of weeks ago like here on the knuckle and it's still not completely right and I'm pretty sure it was doing a load of this it's quite a stiff corner rounder but it only does one at a time so I ordered a industrial heavy duty size one so let's open it okay yay it's certainly bigger than this <laughs> okay ta-da should we test it on something? Okay, I've got some art prints here. I've just got the little one now. Okay. This is exciting. Ooh. Maybe it should be more. It's quite sharp. Look at that. Cornered art prints. Oh, I love it. It's so good. So I've got a little marker at my workplace tomorrow and I've graded the pins and I've just popped some in there and I've got some here. I'm probably going to take a few to the market. I'm not sure how many. Aren't they cute? So this is the maple restock. Maple the mushroom restock. I'm going to take a few of them to the market. I'm going to take some bookmarks to the market. I've also got some storage that I need to sort out for this. I'm going to take key rings, I'm going to take some stickers and sticker sheets, although I don't have many left. I've got a restock arriving for them, but that'll be after this market. But this is just a mini market anyway for like staff at my workplace. I've also got some of these all packaged up, the Cozy Coco Planner Pad and Notepad. These aren't listed on my website yet because they go live next week. But I'm going to take a few to the market and... I mean, I may as well, they're here, so I'll do that. I've got these as a restock, but I'm going to take some of those to the market. We'll take some washi tape as well. And I think that's it for today. I'm going to pack up because it's tomorrow. And I did also buy these little signs, little price signs in like a little rustic kind of wood. Um, and I think it's got some chalk pens as well. So I thought that might look a bit more professional. So I just put together my new storage solutions for my bookmarks which I'm pretty pleased with and I've got extra space here I just got these off Amazon and they match my aesthetic for these shelves um, and they're eco-friendly they'll do for now it's not too bad at all
the laptop, the laptop. I'm just sitting down at the computer to update some stock levels after the market and I ended up getting 15 orders at my little local market with my workplace and um, so I'm just going to fill that in. There we go on my new 75 sale tracker so I'm going to put that back. So I was approached by a company called Sticker It who manufactures stickers. Has that just come on on its own? Must be creepy. So I was approached by a company called Sticker It who wanted to offer me some stickers in some different materials and things. So I sent them some of my new winter designs and they've arrived today. So I'm going to film them for a reel as I unbox them. So I've had a few issues with some of the clear stickers so far but what I'll do is I'll contact the manufacturer and see what they say. These are much too big and they've got white all around the borders unfortunately um, which doesn't look great but there we are. Can you see that? All the white around the borders. So the foil ones with the shine on them, they're absolutely fine and they look really good. They're, they're absolutely fine because they're not clear, there's no white around the edges. So they look really, really good. I'm very happy with those. Right now let's look at maple. And there's maple with the back, the sticky back. So that looks really good as well. Nice and shiny leaves. So cute. Here's the hollow moth. These are a lot bigger than I ordered, that's the only thing wrong with those. But the print quality looks good and the hollow is really nice and the bleed and the cut's really good as well. So I'm just doing the freebie for the eHearts market this weekend and this year I'm doing a little lilac reindeer and he's so cute. I can only fit it on a sheet, I've tried my best to fit another one on but it's just not happening. Um, and I like to keep the margins quite thick for the glitter sticker paper which this is going to be so we're going to test print the glitter versions of these and these are going to be exclusive to the night market uh, not the night market these are going to be exclusive to the eHearts market as freebies for the orders <laughs> arrived my new pins so I'm gonna have a look at them with you my husband had a little look and so I the bags open um, so there should be two designs in here oh, how exciting how exciting oh my god there we go so that's Looney the moth oh it looks so cute look at Looney He's got a little black rubber clutch and it's on uh, maple wood, sustainable maple wood. So I still need to print the batten cards for these, but I think I'm going to go through and count and grade them. Oh wow, look. And there's Oakley. Look how cute he is. Oh, he's so cute. That's Oakley the acorn, again with a black rubber clutch. And I need to print off his backing card as well because they all have specific ones for their little character. Look how cute he is, little Oakley. So yeah, I've got, I think I've got 25 of each. So I'm going to take all of the, um, I'm going to take the peel off them and count them and grade them.
So I haven't been filming much and I'm sorry about that but it's been all systems go because I've got so much to do for the shop update of the new products and also the prep for the market. So I made I made these for the market. These are my freebies. This is the Lilac Rain Digger, which you're gonna get with orders over five pound. Now my Lilac freebie in the summer market did really well. So I thought I would do one for the Christmas market and this will be the only time you can get this little cutie in a lilac colour. So I've got some of those for the market. I've been doing all my product photography. I made some sticker packs. I've only got a small batch of about 20. Well, that's what I'm making at the moment. So I'm just printing labels off for the packs and cutting as well. So I'm going to be making those up as I go. I think I've done about six so far, six or seven. So I've got it up here what I'm printing. Um, so I'm just going to send another pack to print while I'm talking. I like to be efficient. <laughs> I'm also sorting out the website. So I'm just getting the banners ready. Um, I'm doing that at the same time as printing stuff. I've been getting my listings ready. So these are the ones I've got done so far. All the blank ones. I'm waiting for the products to arrive. But they should arrive tomorrow or on the launch day, of which case I can get them photographed quickly. Um, so, yeah, I'm just getting all the graphics done, getting some social media stuff done now, and yeah, we're getting there, slowly. It's now the day of the market, and my sticker sheets arrived last night. I'm so excited. These are restocks that don't need re-photographing because they've got the same logo on. These are race stocks that do need photographing because I updated the logo and things. So I'm going to do those today. These are new. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Look how cute the cosy evening one is. And I've got the warm colour as well. I'll show you. There's the warm coloured cosy evening sticker sheet. It's got like little yarn balls and blankets, candles. It's so cute. I've also done some wax seals for, you know, journaling and cards and things. So they've got like a darker border so you can like take it off and it'll be seamless with no white sticker border. And you can put them on envelopes and, you know, like scrapbooks and things. So that's like a nature version. And then I did a festive version, which I thought was really cute. I love the little gingerbread man. So I've got the wax seal sticker sheets there, which I hope will do well. I really don't know. Um, and I did my logo as like a little wax seal as well. Um, so we've got some designs from last year. This is festive foliage. Look how cute that is. It's got like a sort of muted green and gold theme into it. And then we've got the green version. So I did these last year, but I actually was printing them myself last year. A lot has changed, and now I'm getting them done externally. So there's the traditional green one. I've got a little pine cone. Look at the little pine cone's face. It's so cute. So there's the green one. And then another one from last year was Frosty Flurry. So we've got the classic blue one. and got like some mistletoe berries, snow globes, trees, things like that. And then we've got that in... We've got that in um, like a pinky colour as well. Look at that snowball's face. Look at it. He's dead inside. So I'm going to get on with photographing them now. Um, hopefully it won't take me too long. Maybe a few hours because I'm really finicky about the photographs. But yeah, there you go. There's a little sneak peek shot. And then these will go on the website. And I'll keep you updated throughout the day because the market goes live tonight. My wax seal sticker sheets are looking pretty good on camera and I tested them out on an envelope and I think they look really cute, look at that. Oh, I'm so pleased with them. So this is my sheet and I've done some examples of this and I've done the gingerbread man and the candy cane but I just love them all. I particularly love the little car with the tree on the top. It's so cute. Um, but also, the last products arrived. Oh my god, thank you, Sticker Wrap, for rescuing me. So, these are the replacements that I got from the ones that didn't get printed properly. So, we've got the little cup book stack, 
which is really cute. And we've got Cozy Coco. And these are clear stickers, so I just need to peel one and test them out and get those photographed as well. Look how glossy they are. Right, we're going to have to test one out and count them as well. There's Cozy Coco. Look how glossy that is. Moment of truth. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, that's good. It's nice and clear on the sides. All right, let's check this one. Oh, that's good as well. Yay. Let's get them photographed. a little later in the day now we're up to date I think on everything it's been a long day I've done a lot of photography because the products arrived really late last night or well, they arrived on the evening and um, so I couldn't take photographs because it was dark so I've done that today and I'm at the desk now we've got like 15 minutes till the winter product launch and we've got 15 minutes till the e hearts market goes live and see my battery flashing um, so I'm going to check over all my listings for both Etsy and Shopify and then I think we're good to go and I'm going to do a live stream at half past six and I've got all my products here that I've spent weeks and weeks, um, over a month working on and now they're all here and I'm going to show them off on Instagram. It's all kind of crazy at the minute, um, it's gone live but I've still got some things to do and I've already had an order as well. Shopify went down earlier this evening for everyone um, and it's happening again. <laughs> oh no. There's three people on my shop. Four active carts guys. Four. And I've got to go live in 19 minutes. We've got four active carts and one purchased. Yay. Right I've shared the market link. So we've got that going on. I need to check my store looks okay. We've got someone in Ireland. I'm gonna have to start setting up my phone for this live stream as well. I've got a tripod here. Oh, oh my God. We have another one from Leanne. Thank you, Leanne. Oh my God, it makes me so happy. A cozy evening sticker sheet, festive foliage and a winter creatures sticker pack, which is this one here. Yay! I'll show you my website. So this is the new website. We've got the eHearts banner on the front and then that changes to the winter collection. Um, this looks better on mobile law, to be honest. And then we've got wooden pins, we've got sticker sheets and the YouTube one last. And I've changed the colour scheme to like red and green. And I've got a little freebie section here for the freebie over the weekend. And then we've got the winter collection here. Which is good, it all seems to be in the right category and things. Um, and we've got the wax seal sticker sheets there. How good's that? And I think it's all, I've even made a little one for stocking fillers. So like pins and bookmarks and key rings and things. I've popped in there. It all, I think it's all okay now. Oh my god, there's an Etsy order! Yay! That's three! I'm going to write them on my tracker. Guys, there are eight people on my website. I never have eight! Oh my god! <gasps> Five checking out. Oh my god, this is insane. And I've got people on Etsy. I just turned the camera off to get ready for the live and I got a 66 pound order. 66. How many items? 
24 items. I think it might be like everything in the update. Oh my gosh. Plus more. Double on some things. Oh my god. Laura. Thank you so much. Oh my god. This is just... This is just insane, right? I really need to get ready for the live stream now. I just finished the live stream and it went so well. I had nearly 20 people on, which never happens with Instagram Live. So that was amazing and a great start to the market. I've had nine orders, six on my website and three on Etsy. It's It's gone so well. So I think I'm done in the studio for tonight. I'm going to go and browse the market now and do a little bit of self-care. But um, it's been a busy day. I think it'll pay off this weekend, so yeah, I'm gonna sign off for tonight. <laughs>